Hello, calculus students. Uh, this this uh, tutorial is going to talk about Desmos and using the rectangular approximation method uh, program. Just to give you a little bit, here is the uh, function. You may change this to whatever you want. Um, so if I were to put in here 9 minus x squared, you can see that the function is going to change, and you do have these rectangles already in here. Uh, your left endpoint is the A, if you want to change that you obviously can and you can also slide it so B is a, a 3 right here if I were to move it around you can see that you're going to have some negative area in red if I, want, if I just wanted to go to 2 and be more, yeah, there it is B is 2 uh, you can see that there is all the rectangles in there right now I have 12 uh, let me reduce that to something smaller there's 2 so this is going to be a left endpoint uh, rectangle approximation if you would like to see a right angle or right, uh, uh, a right approximation method, change your C to a 1, and there's the right, and that's going to be an underestimate. You can also use 0.5, and that's going to give you a middle. Um, if you would like to see more than, let's see here, N is 1. Oh, I have 100 right here. So 100 is the most. Uh, you can always click on that and change it to 500 like in your book. Um, and you can always zoom in a little bit. But there are rectangles in there. There they are. Very, very small. 500 of them. Okay, I hope that gives you enough background to go ahead and complete um, the assignment. But this is a pretty useful tool for your, using your Chromebook and Desmos. Thank you.